Hey guys, what's up? The Suicide Squad trailer two or three is out, uh, and me and other Joe are gonna do a trailer reaction. Just for you guys. So Batman vs Superman had mixed results, and I'm hoping that the the DC universe gets a little injection, a little kick in the ass of awesomeness from uh, Suicide Squad. No, I mean, no, we, we, we know. Hope. I'm not saying you know BB Superman is bad. I'm just saying that you know WB needs a little help. So let's see how 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 we do this. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Gentlemen, ladies. What if Superman had decided to fly down? Superman! Rip off the roof of the White House. Grab the president right out of the Oval Office. Who would have stopped him? He wouldn't do that! So su I want to build a team of some very bad people who I think can do some good. Y'all jokers must I don't know be crazy. Superman... That seems an incredibly stupid idea. You think Superman will be stopped by these guys? What? Huh? No. This is the deal. <laughs> you disobey me, you die. I was a little distracted, Joe. Joe, there goes Joe! That's what his powers are, ropes. He's gonna die, Joe. Known to be quite vexing. I'm just forewarning you. You die. If they get caught, we throw them under the bus. Woo! What a ride! Let's play. Come on, got some better turn? I love this guy. Good. <laughs> Don't forget, we're the bad guys. I Joker. Just sweet talk to me. All of that chit chat's gonna get jarred. I was just trying to get you there. You know how I feelings, right? We good. <laughs> what you having? Beer. Whiskey. What am I, 12? How about you have stuff? Water. That's a good idea, honey. <laughs> All right, all right, a pretty good. A lot of action. A lot of action. I like that, so that's pretty cool. A lot of action, a lot of jokes, a yes. lot of jokes, which is a good thing. We want we to lighten, lighten it up a little bit. We don't have to go super light. We don't have to go Marvel, but, you know, <laughs> no, this whole Superman is a bad guy idea that, that it seems like the DCU is drifting further and further towards is, uh, is really bothering me, guys, but okay. Okay, a lot, lot to go through here, so let's uh, try to do this a little at a time. Uh, we got an opening shot here, establishing the wine house, establishing this like ridiculous scenario yes, that Superman uh, could go and, and beat up uh, the President of the United States. I'm so sick and tired of people painting Superman as a bad guy, but I guess it's just all part of the DCU's realistic take on the Superman mythos where everybody's afraid of him. God, they just don't humanize him enough, and they haven't humanized him enough. And hopefully, they'll do that with the Justice League. We'll see. Okay. Croc, I gotta say, Croc just looks stupid to me. Is this the one that doesn't look quite right to me? To me. Do you think he likes good? He needs a tail. I like. I like how his uh, his um, his Little prison cage. cell is is uh, themed like a sewer for him. Well, certainly not the Suicide Squad. They don't have the skills or, or the necessary <laughs> tools to stop Superman. Uh, but the point he's making here is is interesting. We we probably need a specialist squad for these types of meta heroes that may show up. Maybe not ones as powerful as Superman, but and we get the Joker laugh, which reminded uh, Joe of 
the ending scene where Jack Nicholson dies. <laughs> Insert that clip right here. Yeah. All right, we got Harley doing her Harley thing. Okay, so I think these injections are uh, the famous tracker devices where their heads will explode. Uh, if they do anything outside of what they're supposed to be doing as the Suicide Squad. Obviously, the government isn't going to let take these... Take any chances. Take Fuck any that. chances, right. These are criminals. Okay. God, it looks like a... But there comes Joe! <laughs> Joe's in the movie! He's gonna, he's gonna die! <laughs> Joe's so scared that Slipknot is gonna be the one to die. And honestly, if you look at him, he looks to be the character you could get rid of the easiest without Ouch. anybody crying about it. I so would cry. Keep it keep in mind whether other Joe lives or dies during the movie. And it looks like he comes in all, you know, differently from the rest of the squad. <laughs> he is uh, escorted by some FBI. SUV. Yeah, SUV. Fancy. FBI guys don't really know what his powers is. Slipknot is the power of making fucking knots, Joe. Look at his braids. Yeah. He did that himself. Oh, that's a good power. That's a good power. Okay, and Amanda Waller comes up with a crazy idea. I'm not really convinced of it right there where let's put a bunch of bad guys together and let's have them do cool things. But as you know, if you've read the comics, it is fucking awesome. So I'm glad that we're seeing this story. And it, 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 even DC Animation was a little scared about, uh, you know, doing uh, about how the sales would be for Suicide Squad. So they put like Batman as the headliner, even though Batman's not in it very much. Uh, but here they're they're little they're little uh, doing the opposite. It's just straight up Suicide Squad. Doesn't have Batman branding anywhere. But rumor has it, Joe, that Batman's in the film a lot more than we think he is, and we see that in the trailer. So here we're looking at Harley like Quinn more than uh, Wonder Woman was. M yeah, I, well, uh, this is just rumors right now. <laughs> well, no, we'll see. Probably about as much as Wonder Woman Jeez. was in Batman vs Superman. Um, so a nice little cameo like this. This is a pretty badass gun. We're probably going to see plenty of uh, props and cosplayers doing their Harley thing, since Harley is being popularized by the very talented Margot and she uh, I think has nailed it in every single trailer I just wish there was more of a Harley voice we're, we're having to do a completely new Harley and accept one without the iconic voice Was everybody oogling her body at that point? I think point? so. Great. We're going to have to hear about that from the internet. Oh, there you go, Joe. There's your power. He says, later, suckers. I ain't dying. So that's maybe, your power. Maybe, maybe. He shoots things, knots, and then he flies up. That's actually kind of cool. Look at vantage point. Yeah, so I don't know. It looks like they were under fire or got fucked up. Why are they pointing his gun at him, though? No, no, no. Was... They're pointing their guns at him. <laughs> yeah, but it, it may be that, that that it's in reverse editing order that they got attacked from above and Slipknot is going up there to go and attack the enemy. Could be. You die. No, my You irritate or vex me. I'm known to be quite vexing. I'm just forewarning you. You die. <laughs> she looks like she's got some really nice, funny lines. Uh, what we see here is Midway City, and it looks fucked up. It looks like something is going on. Is that normal? No, that's not normal, Joe. <laughs> There's fucking fire going on. It looks like possibly a war zone because the, here comes the Suicide Squad, right? And they get shot down. Bup, 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 bup. So they're fighting a military force of some kind with guns and anti-aircraft. And they love the fact that they they are just like woohoo! That was right. So, crazy. do you think anybody died right there no. from that crash? Every single one of them are just yeah, fine like, as well. well. <laughs> there goes our mission. All right. Well, obviously, uh, Captain Boomerang here is fine. He finally whips out some boomerangs. Got Katana doing her thing. Yeah, I, I don't know Robocop's character. I think it's, uh, I don't know, I think I read something like Alpha One or something that he's a badass. But uh, she she really looks like she's going to steal the movie, honestly. She's in every single scene. I'm just glued to her and, and just wondering what she's going to say. And of course, Will Smith. Okay, so here we get a good shot of our bad guys, which 
seem to be a, a combination that they seem to be spec ops soldiers but, but fucked up yeah like mutated or something. mutated yeah that's a that's a good <laughs> word so there's uh there there's rumors that this this has to be doing mystical shit if you've seen the other scene in the subway where and we'll see that oh, here in okay. a second uh where the powers are being used we're seeing mystical stuff and we know the enchantress is in here so uh maybe this movie then opens up the door for the you know the dark justice league dark and constantine and that kind of stuff uh I like and ma magical stuff within the well which con you like keanu constantine Yes. You do? I like I it. I, did like I, didn't, it. I didn't mind it either. A lot of people liked it, but yeah. I liked it. Yeah, I liked it. I liked it too. But we're not going to see <laughs> Keanu in the DC <laughs> yeah, yeah, but they do look fucked see, up. Look like right barnacles, here, like... tentacles or something. What? Yeah. Continue. You'll but he's got a head. unicorn here. What is this? And fi But he's, he's using his boomerangs finally. Is he a daughter? Shit. I don't know much about boomerangs. I don't know. I don't know. And here's... Here's uh, Harley Quinn doing her spinny Flips. thing. I've never understood this... You know, her leg. If I was a guy and a That's lady like was spinning moves. on me, I would That's just pick her up moves. and pull down. Pull down. What? You, you wouldn't have enough time. I wouldn't have enough time. She's like, like, Harley's just running full speed. Like, what the hell? Then all of a sudden, as soon she, she scissors out. my face. So, you know, you'd be in heaven for one second and then your neck snaps for the next second and then you'd be in hell. Heaven go. and hell. We'll call that maneuver <laughs> heaven and hell. Shit. What? Did wrestling move. <laughs> There's the a uh, good shot of the enchantress, and doesn't it look like her smoke thing it looks yeah. similar to what we saw around those those guys? She's probably not linked to it, but I'm just saying this is magical in the DC universe, and those guys might be generated from a magical. The one uh, uh, factor we haven't factored in here is Common, the rapper, is in this movie. He has a role, and we think that he is the main bad, bad guy. guy. But, as you see here, the trailer takes it. There's a lot in this trailer. There is. This trailer is super detailed. This is great, WB. You're getting... You're getting, getting better, better at your trailers without giving away yeah, what the hell is going there's on. There's a lot, but not enough to give it away. You're so not playing a consecutive scene where it's like we know exactly what's happening. This is cool. This is speculation. So it's good they fired that last guy and then did the, the latest Batman vs Superman trailer. And this one's good too. Okay, so we got this side thing with Joker. And of course, Harley's like, uh-oh. So it looks like the Suicide Squad is going to come into conflict with Joker, a Joker's team. It's going to be interesting seeing the meeting between Harley and the Joker again. Don't forget. We get a good shot of the Joker there, though we've seen him in that outfit before. The jacket. What do you think of this Joker, dude? He, lo he looks fierce. And looks I know he's a younger guy. Younger version. It's good. He's psychotic. This this is gonna be unlike any other Joker we've seen before. I have faith in Jared Leto, but honestly, it's so different that I obviously I've have said a lot about it where I'm nervous. We'll see. He's a good actor. Mm -hmm. uh, Will Smith. Will Smith is going to be the factor in this movie that that's that I think holds it together and makes me like it. It's very hard for me not to like a Will Smith movie unless he teams up with like Shyamalan, you know, and I am, what is that, Earth, so yeah, After imagine. Earth, that shit was terrible. But I, I think I like almost every single one of Will Smith's movie except for that one. So you're, you're gonna, you're, you're already on my good side with some Will Smith that shot up in here. It would be so cool to see Superman in this film. And she's got her iconic tool right there. That's right, Joe. It's a weapon. Ooh, where the hell did she get this? But she's happy to have it. Yes, uh, there's my mallet. This, this new version of Harley, this is closer to the comic book version of Harley, or, or her costume is. I would love to see Harley in her original cartoon outfit, because that's my favorite outfit for Harley. Maybe we'll see it in a future film if they do Suicide Squad 2 or something, but she's got her mallet here, and she's super happy about it. It says, ha, 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 war, warm... Some wanna play? Wanna play? Nice, Joe. All right, let's do it. Ooh. We have Batman. Ooh, okay. Let's analyze this scene. We've got Batman. Okay, so obviously, I got it. Harley is in prison, and she has to become a part of Suicide Squad. I guarantee That's when, uh, you. He was torturing her, right? In the first trailer. Ah, so you think? Uh, yeah, he was torturing Joker her. Joker tortures her. Yeah, and he tries to save her. 
So it's immediately, really there's no Harley uh, Joker team up where they're bad guys together for many no. years. You think he transforms her, uh, maybe tortures her or something, and then discards her, and Batman has to come in and save her. That is my guess, yes. Okay, no, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's legitimate because we see here Batman saving her, obviously. Joker is all crazy. Oh, there we go. I, now, see, this could be clever editing because it looks like she's falling uh, back in concrete Yeah. while Batman is jumping towards water. So I'm not sure if these scenes SB. tie together. This is definitely a different scene yeah, where sure. she's already on the Suicide Squad. And that is Batman probably saving her pre-Suicide Squad after Joker transforms her. Chantress, Deadshot looks cool with his mask. That that looks fucking awesome. It looks huge though. Like he has plenty of room in there, like to air conditioning, television I think set. So. <laughs> yeah. She looks fucking creepy. She looks creepy, but creepy in a good way. And that's she, what, what is she wearing? She like that's like what some, happens when you play the Ouija Egyptian. Board. That's what happens. Yeah. <laughs> Your yeah. eyes glow and you get fucking powers. You get possessed. Oh shit, man! I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get a Ouija board if I can get powers <laughs> like that. And all of a sudden, a, a chainmail bikini appears on me. That's that, what, that's, what you that's want? why you no, don't, don't play want, the Ouija board because you get a chainmail bikini. I don't, I don't want a bikini. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. It's... Boo 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 boo. See, what the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Uh, that was a hot chick giving you a wink, Joey. Ain't nothing better than that. No, well, that. that yes. Yeah, okay. So, yes, these are like tentacle barnacle shit. It's creeping me out already. But uh, Katana's it's a doing, fucking plague. doing a work. Yes, it's a plague. So, it seems like it's military that has been infected by something. And we did see this green tentacle, which I think matches up with a different shot in the subway of those oh, those green. She's probably getting captured. Yeah, she's getting captured or tied up. This is torture scene. And she, that is see, definitely that's, that's be. Harleen, uh, as she was a, a, a doctor, a psychiatrist, I think, in Arkham yeah. before she met the Joker. This is definitely Harley's transformation. Where the Joker is, no idea at right here. Uh, I would have assumed that he either pushed her or she willingly transforms herself. We'll see. We do know that he brings her out of the vat. Uh, comes down here. So this is going to be a very interesting uh, cre uh, you know, origin story we've not seen in film. The origin story of Harley. So I'm really looking forward to seeing how they handle that. Uh, here, this is definitely the enchant. Yeah, she's being possessed. So she... The, this is the origin. Are they going to tell everybody's origin? Damn, <laughs> this movie is going to be jam bad. It'll be pretty cool, though. I yeah? want to know. You want to know origin? Yeah, because I'm tired, obviously. The right. same ones over and over. Mm -hmm. It'll be kind of interesting to right. see them take see. on some new characters. Do you think it can fit in the film? Oh, yeah, for sure. There's six or seven origins. For sure. Okay. Oh, man. Joker looks fucked up here what happened is he in a fight with batman kind of <laughs> yeah and look at this area somebody pointed this out on twitter this area looks seek sneakily similar to the area batman vs superman was in but no i'm i'm pulling back about that because this is a square pillar here on this right side instead of a round pillar like i think it was in batman vs superman so i don't think they're in the same area but this Joker, I am, so, I'm excited, man. Uh, what is, why is he trying? What is going on here? He's got a gold gun. We have a Hispanic superhero, <laughs> finally. El Diablo. El Diablo, and he's so stereotypical. El Diablo is muy caliente. <laughs> So, so, oh God. Okay, fine. We we get one, and he's gonna die. I think that Slipknot, Slipknot and Diablo, I think, die. The two Hispanics. Yep. Well, actually, I'm gonna, the other one's like more Indian. Well, I, well, yeah, it's true. But people assume he's Hispanic. Yeah. And then uh, we have Batman. The now, rumored Batman in this a lot more than we think he is, and I would I would love it. Yep. That's a good idea, honey. All right. That's it. What did you think? 
Very interested about seeing this film, obviously. Mm -hmm. The trailers have not ruined it, and this is the third one, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, this is the third one. It has not been ruined. I'm still very intrigued by it. Yeah. Uh, Does it make you want to see the movie more or less? More. Yes. Way more. And the... And the previous Batman vs Superman trailer wanted me to see it more. So you the saw one it. before that, less because they fucked it you up. Saw it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so Warner Brothers did a good job promoting this one. I think that uh, as people are getting this mixed reaction with Batman vs Superman, I think Suicide Squad looks really, really good. I would be surprised if it had a mixed reaction. I think it's going to be great. Uh, whereas we gave Batman vs Superman like a seven out of ten. You did. And I gave it like a seven, and then it went down to a six or a five. Uh, it's my, still a good yeah, film. Yeah, my prediction is this one is probably going to be more fun to watch than Batman vs oh, Superman. Yeah. What do you think? By far. And yeah. it's it kills me to say that because I'm all about soups, and and I could use a lot more soups. And well, that's a separate video, separate discussion yes. on how I think they're fucking up Superman. We're going to get less like Superman in this movie, universe, guys. Yeah. Be so, excited about this mm-hmm. one. All right, guys, so uh, that's our opinion on it. Leave yours in the comments. Super interested to see what you think of the Suicide Squad, and we'll see you guys on the next Angry Joe Show. Bye, guys. See you guys.